Welcome to Norfolk Perspectives. I'm Bob Batcher, and I never, ever thought I'd see what you're getting ready to see. Jeff Harrison in a leather jacket <laughs> on the sofa. Yeah, about it. You look good in that. <laughs> Thank you. It's, it's comfortable. That, you I really like it? it? I, I love it. You're going to stroll all it. the way back to the Christ Museum of Art now, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. I never thought I'd have you guys. Yes, I did, because things are different at the Christ Museum of Art. Jeff Harrison, chief curator for the Christ Museum of Art. And Ann Corsa, you get to keep us now in frame here, because you're the educator there. That's right. So how do you educate about leather jackets? You have fun. You get people to look at it, you get people to talk about it, and most importantly, you get them to try it on and engage with it. Oh, you get to try them on? Too? Yes. Because, you know, there's a little Fonz work in there. Oh, yeah, there's lots of Fonz. We've got everybody. <laughs> We've got Marlon Brando. We've got everybody from uh, early bikers all the way up through uh, punk and then right on into high fashion. And Marlon Brando along the way. And Elvis's motorcycle and his leather jacket that he bought in 1960 from J.C. Penney. From J.C. Penney? J.C. Penney. He got rich a little later, <laughs> but he bought, and he bought his motorcycle on the uh, installment plan. Oh, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, okay. I, whose idea was this? Well, it was, it was a, a, a group idea. We were looking for a show in September, this, this fall, uh, to reopen the special exhibition program, and we were looking for something unusual, something along the lines of the Ferrari exhibition that we did about 10 years ago. Uh, and we came across this show that dealt with an American icon, an art form, it really is. Um, and treated it as an art form. So it worked for us as an art museum. It's, it's like a costume show, but it's, um, it's very um, democratic uh, and it's very contemporary. So that's why we did it. Okay, and I got to tell you, some of my friends on Facebook are showing up now on Facebook mm -hmm. on the back of a motorcycle. That's right. We have a very interactive section of the show where people can hop on uh, one of the Harley Davidson motorcycles, put on a leather jacket, uh, multiple sizes, multiple colors, <laughs> and um, take their pictures. They can send them out. They can post them to the Chrysler Museum's website, Facebook, and it's a great way for people to engage with it in a digital way, the way people are so um, often doing these days. Okay, do you still have people come and say, where's the duck? <laughs> Once in a while. I mean, it's, come on, let's face it. Well, you, they don't actually ask where he is. They figured out he's not out front, but they ask when he's coming back. You know, I've got the, the, the analogy that's kind of really hit home with me is the, 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 the butterfly is in the cocoon for a while, and there's an awful lot of learning going on while you're in that cocoon. When you guys were closed, you guys, you must have been thinking a lot. Well, we were thinking about how we were going we to reintroduce ourselves to the public. Absolutely. And it's worked. I mean, yeah. that's great to hear. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, we did come by. I kind of waited for the crowds. We came through the, uh, the museum before this show, so I've got to get over there and see it. Mm -hmm. Awesome museum. Great. Great. And the food was good, too. Yes. New cafe. Good. You know? Yeah, right inside the front door. So. So what's, what do you have up your sleeve for, uh, for the next couple of months then while this show is here? <laughs> well, one of the most exciting things we're doing with this show is our third Thursday in December. We are partnering with some of the most creative people in Norfolk, and that is the students at the Governor's School of the Arts. Uh oh boy. And so what we are going to do is put on a fashion show. Actually, they are putting on a fashion show. They're designing, they're modeling. Uh, there will be a full-on run runway, judges panel, musician, and they are creating a denim jacket because for students, denim is the new leather. Oh, okay. oh. Um, and it's going to be a terrific night for everyone, for the students, for the parents, and for the whole community. Well, I was thinking when you were talking about runway, I was thinking Jeff would be perfect, but <laughs> it's taken us how many years to get him into leather? <laughs> I, w do you wear denim? Huh? Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, 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 yeah some yeah, denim on now. Yeah, yeah. So we can get him on the runway? I think, think we're going to get him to MC. Um, yeah. Ah. Yeah, good luck. Go. <laughs> <laughs> so the show runs till January. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. And then what? January. Come on. Oh, yeah. golly. We have a whole oh, series of shows after that. Lots of uh, video games after that. Oh, yeah. On. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. The art of video games. Yep. Yeah. Now, Jeff, think about this. You go to one of your, I guess, curators have conferences, right? Sure. You, you guys, you, you, you kind of commingle. We do. So. You're going to be showing up at these in your leather, your new leather jacket. Yep. And pushing video games. And pushing video we're, games. We're mm -hmm. going to do it. It's going to be a great show. It's going to be um, a, a group of uh, playable games, and uh, it's going to survey the entire history 
of, of the video game is art. It's, it is, and it really and is. it's high playable, high. all playable. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, but, yeah. but I got to say, I, one of the most enjoyable postings I saw on Facebook during the holiday season were your docents. Good. That was so cool. Great. And it wasn't video games and leather. It was really into what we traditionally thought of as the museum. Absolutely. And we are still, you know, despite all of these wonderful exhibitions, we have an incredible permanent collection uh, that runs from ancient worlds, ancient Egypt, through contemporary art and glass. And people are coming every day and want to learn about it. It's still an incredible part of our student curriculum mm -hmm. here. Our volunteer docents love to talk with people uh, about our collection. And so you can get almost anything at the Chrysler. That's awesome. Well, thanks for joining us. I, I'm just still <laughs> totally amazed with Jeff and Leather. Move on down the road, teams, to come to my mind. <laughs> thanks for doing this. Great Absolutely. stuff at the Chrysler. And really kind of getting out of the box and inviting the box back in. Yeah. Thank when we you. come back, we're going to be talking about the new website of Dominion, and you can see your neighbor's lights are on. Stay tuned.